guys welcome back to my channel it's G from happiness and crafting so today I'm just doing a little bit of organizing um, I feel like just like sorting some bits and pieces out um, I really should have put the video on the turn the camera on earlier really um, but I've been adding um, my sea beads I had quite a few sea beads um, and I'm starting to use them a little bit more because I'm doing some more slow stitching um, and I'm actually incorporating sort of like beads and things in with them in with the sewing so I brought these little pots I had a few um, before but I got these off Amazon two different sizes I'll pop the links down below um, shall I give it a quick measure they look pretty tiny but they pack in quite a lot of um, these seed beads um, and I'm just loving them and they're so much easier to use in sort of like one color boxes if you know what I mean so that's just over two inches or what's that nearly seven centimeters or five centimeters by two inches so they look quite small but they really are really really handy um, and the bigger one is three and three quarter inches or nine and a half centimeters by two and a half inches what am I doing or what's that six and a quarter centimeters so they're a really really nice size um, and I've got these little plastic things which I've had ages I've had a long time I got three of them and they just fit perfect so I'm just popping them in like this so it's not just for my sea beads I've got some little gems in here as well um, I've got some bigger ones I want to put the other ones I've got three different sizes in those I've got my little chain as well nice crystally chain in there in two different colors um, and it just I just find it quite easy but again we all go through phases don't we so I've got three different size um, sea beads in there oh look we've got a gray one in there um, of sorting things out and organizing it um, but this for now I find really really simple and they're lovely so I take these downstairs and then I can just take one pot use the colors that I want clip it up and then pop it back um, which is lovely now the tiny tiny ones look they will slightly pop out these are two mil beads um, and there's a tiny gap in there so you might lose a couple because um, you, you can see it's just getting stuck in there but nothing they're not going to get muddled up that's my lovely green ones which I don't have very many of those left I've got this one but which I'm going to take off and put the rest of these and these are BB crafts um, which I want to pop in there so pop me gold ones down there so that's that size and then I've got the bigger ones now these ones are empty ones which I can fill um, but these are some bigger sea beads um, which are just beautiful there's my lovely little like bubbles they remind me of little bubbles so it's not just sea beads I've got beads in here I've got some lovely little flowers so it's more of easy access so I've got them and I'm going to pop them sort of like near me so when I'm doing things I've you know I've got them to hand um, and then I've got these funny little plastic things which I think are quite pretty they're like little um, bells little flowers on there but they're really really lovely and I've got those in pink two different sort of pinks and a white um, which are lovely again you can have your little charms in there I've got some sequins I'm not going to put these sequins the bag broke so that's why I pop those in there um, but I'm not going to waste money on putting sequins in these um, because they're in their little bags and here so I've got some more in here um, these are all empty ones which I need to fill up but I'm just loving it so I thought I'd just share with you um, you know a storage another storage idea so I've got these I've just taken these and i am pop them into there like that and then I'm just going to cut these off because I'm not going to use them like this so let me just so on a little bit of wire I don't want to put them in here so they don't all you know fly all over the place um, 
but yeah today I just fancied by doing just a little bit of organizing a bit of a, a bit of a no-brainer thing really isn't it it's just something that's well I think about what I really want to do this afternoon I thought I would just have a little just a little organize um, and it just makes you feel better doesn't it just have a little sort out so pop these all in here these are beautiful but when I ordered them from BB craft I didn't really I didn't oops I didn't realize they would be so small um, I didn't really look at the size properly um, but they fit my lovely beading needle so I'm really really pleased and I've actually made a few little embellishment things is with them um, which I will show you at some point let's just take these off these are just on little bits of um, metal wire so they can go in there oh so that's why I didn't want to happen lots of little beads everywhere so let's just pick them up pop them in there we go and then they can just go in there perfect look at that close it up and then we've got all of them and then I love them because I like see-through things because I'm a very visual person like I've said before so if I see something then I'll want to use it um, more so than if I hide it in a drawer so that goes in there I have got some more of these which I ordered and these I believe I think I'm going to put them in there for a second I think they're a different size to these these are a little bit more shiny I think aren't they on there so I'm going to pop these into a little one oh here's a spare one pop those in there so there we go we can see those which is fab they can be tucked in let me move this one out of the way they can go in here with all the little crystally bits I think I had some more I did see some on here yeah here we go and then I think what I'm going to do I'm going to get some of my charms I did put my charms in here but I think I'm going to take the beads out of these boxes and put the charms in because this is where I've got my lovely ones for the time for tea journal I've sorted them out my little teapots and little knives and forks and things like that um, so if they're on the side they're not going to go over the top of these so I think I'll just sort my charms out and put them into these boxes oh look what are these oh they're pretty and I've got some little mixed pearls well they can go in here can't they and then I've got a great big supply of these little bags as well um, in the drawer look at that see don't they look so pretty so that can fit in there these tiny tiny little these are beautiful let's have a look should we pop these in one of these oh they would look lovely wouldn't they on um, slow stitching projects because they're all lovely and shiny they're lovely glass ones beautiful oh look here we go these are the bigger ones they're lovely let's pop those in the box oh, we don't want that so this is the bit where you it's so hard to take things out of these little compartments um, to put them in but once you open this because the lid I think it's because the lid goes right back you have really easy access and because I was using some downstairs um, over the last few nights when I was sewing doing some slow stitching adding beads it's so much easier to use to open up oh, look I've got some charms in there let's have another little box you can put these charms in here some odd beads so look all of these can go in here I can't remember where I got the long trays from um, uh, I think I need to get a few more of them I think the reason that I like um, 
they had bigger ones like this and I got these ones because these ones didn't fit in these trays um, I think this was a BB craft one um, which something came in it but it didn't fit in the in the tray so I opted for the smaller ones and I'm quite pleased I have actually um, because they're a really nice size so let's just pop these in here there we go perfect look at that some nice little charms so these can go down here so you can sort of colour coordinate I could probably put little bits of chain in but I won't waste that but can you see now you can see exactly you know we could colour coordinate it can't you so and um, we can actually see what you've got and just sort of like take them out and use them so love them love them now I do have these which are beautiful and I think these will probably go in a bigger box like this because these are in a drawer these are in my drawer and I don't see them um, do you mean? Do you think that's going to do up? Oh, look, perfect. So they can go in that one there, and then I have a spare little pot, which is good. So what else have I got? I bought these a while back. They're a little bit bright for me, but I wanted them to go in the middle of flowers. But the crystally ones are quite nice and the purple ones but you never know I think if I make a um, little what's it called journal like a gypsy journal or a boho journal I think they would work really well so this is why I want to sort of like start gathering all my little bits and pieces up so I can see what I've got and it will give me ideas for different journals Okay, so that can go in there. These ones I think I'm going to just leave like that. These are ones that um, are just BB, not BB Crafts. I think I got these from Chimu. Um, there's some tiny little, little um, screw things in there. Which are nice. And these are nice because they just clip. So, as you can see, I've got some little charms in this one. That's all I had left, I think, from the um, Shabadeshri journal and they fitted in here perfect and they just clip shut oh look I've got some more chain maybe I should put that in here with this one do you think it will fit oops let me find it let's have a look I don't think it's going to fit is it in there with that I think this is crystal these ones are the AB ones and these are the lovely purpley ones and I've got a funny feeling maybe I'll put them in a bigger one because if they're all together um, it'd be a lot easier to do wouldn't it then have them separate then I've got a nice little selection perfect that's it better so that can go into that one. Oh, I've got a little bit of chain left over Let's take this little bit, pop that in there. Lovely. There we go. And then I do have some little tiny ones, little bees and stuff in here, um, which are great. So just love it. So this is what's making me happy at the moment. Just having a little bit of a sort out, a little bit of a tidy up. Um, I'm going to have to go through this, aren't I? But then. I don't mind because sometimes when you're in that sort of like um, mood sort of like it's a bit um, just sit here and have a think about what I'm going to be doing in my next um, video or how to do my tea time journal and things like that it's quite nice to just mindlessly do a chore isn't it um, so this is how exciting my afternoon or my morning is um, which is lovely beautiful sunshine outside I shall get a few of this done I don't think I will be doing too much of this I think it might be a little bit tedious 
because it's so difficult getting your fingers in there to get these out you know what I mean but I will give it a go because these are beautiful actually I could use these pink ones um, in the bit of slow stitching I'm doing at the moment they would look absolutely gorgeous so there we go guys I thought I would just let you know how I'm going to be storing my beads from now so this is a good one for um, I don't know like I said we go through phases on different ways we want to store things um, and I think individually at the moment is quite a good idea um, for me but I love them so I do have let's just pop here I do have this as well one of these if you can see it's like little stacky ones um, and I have all sorts of bits and pieces let me just open this up so I mean I have all sorts of bits and pieces um, in these so I've got some Christmas charms um, I've got little pegs I've got little stars look I've got some little googly eyes it's amazing what you collect see I've got wooden bits the bottom of these are all sort of like wooden bits in there but I never really use any of this so I need to sort it out this one is got lots of little sort of well there's some more of those little crystals buttons and all sorts so I could have a good rummage through there later I think and maybe use some of those pop that over there I have another smaller one here which again I've got pegs I've got bows um, it'd be quite nice to actually just use it for like uh, little fabric embellishments wouldn't it oh this is what see this is what I was looking for I was looking for these where's my little pot pop those in there because look at these these are just beautiful aren't they I have so many bits and pieces in this room it's crazy so I'm going to take those out these are really nice because they're just like little resin roses you see they're beautiful aren't they they can go in the pot because I think I would probably like to use those and then in the bottom one what have we got in the bottom one I do like these storage units though they're really good oh look I've got lots of little bows so maybe I would pop all the fabricy little fabricy embellishments into this one. Um, let's pop that back there. So I think, oopsie daisy. These one, you think they're all fit in there? Two different sizes, but they're just lovely, aren't they? It's perfect. So that can go in there. I think this will fit a little one or a big one. What do you think? It might have to be a big one. Can't remember where I got these now. I think I just got them locally. I didn't order them. There we go. I think I just got them locally from um, one of the little shops here. Now, are these the same? What did I do with those? I think they are, aren't they? Just gorgeous. Oops. They are, aren't they? Yes. Beautiful glass, these are. Look at that. Just lovely, aren't they? Okay, so my little magpie bit today, holding all these bits, sorting these out. So there we go, guys. I just thought I'd let you know how I'm storing these and how easy I'm finding it at the moment. Um, you've probably all got your ways of, of organising um, and putting it but this this way isn't working for me at the moment not for little beads um, because as you can see it's just going everywhere um, so I will do a little bit of this a little bit of mindless sorting um, and see how far I get so there we go guys well thank you so so much for joining me I'll pop a link down um, so you can have a look at these boxes um, and then I can't remember I think I got these locally the little um, the little boxes to go in them the little long ones they're lovely um, but if I can remember 
I think I got them locally but these ones I got on these little ones are from Timo and these are from Amazon so there we go guys have a lovely lovely rest of the day take care stay safe and I will see you soon all right guys bye bye